Like and subscribe to our channel, Fabulous Patia Media Group, by using the link below. The Thai government has acknowledged that the current fuel pricing globally, combined with the Russian war in Ukraine, isn't going to be over at any time soon. As a result, businesses and employees will get a break, seeing Social Security payments reduced from 5 to 1% for a period of time. The current diesel subsidies will be extended until the end of May, and many debts held by farmers suspended. Those living on welfare will receive additional subsidies for cooking gas, and motorcycle taxis who are registered will get discounts on fuel too. Anyone using less than 300 units of electricity per month from May through to August will enjoy a 22 satang per unit relief. There is a good chance that further relief will be given in an effort to shore up businesses and to assist those on low incomes. A further 25 students have been charged with involvement in the hazing of a junior university student that led to his death some weeks ago. As investigators finalised their work, so it's been established that junior students had, in the large number, been plied with drink, forced to strip and then beaten. The university itself is also investigating. Finally, a local killer in Cabinbury has been rounded up, this time a male elephant, renowned for raiding farms and killing at least one local. 150 forest workers hunted him down, sedated him and returned him to protected and safer areas allocated to wildlife. Not as easy as it sounds, as in addition to having to hoist him up onto a truck, it took all of five tranquilizer darts to put him into a temporary sleep. Meanwhile at home and in our own region, for the latest COVID numbers this morning, please visit our website or YouTube for the numbers in our text version of the news. With a bike licence only issued a few weeks ago, a 19-year-old Chinese teenager lost control of his big bike on 2nd Road near John TM, seeing him die at the scene. Witnesses report that he was riding at high speed and hit the central reservation before losing control completely. Family and his embassy have been informed and a routine autopsy will take place in Bangkok. And a competition for locals today. If you're in Pattaya this weekend, why not enter our prize draw? This time for a pair of tickets to the International Seafood Buffet at the Holiday Inn this coming Saturday. Worth 2,400 baht. But with us, it's free. Simply visit our website, alwayspatia.com and message us with your answer to the extremely tough question... What's the name of the upcoming Thai New Year holiday? Don't forget, you have to be in it to win it. And today's weather? Well, the Met Office promises continued storms, highs of 31, dropping down to 26. Local and national news today from Fabulous 103 FM and Fabulous Patia Media Group. And to get a notification every time we release another bulletin or programme.